Field and Stream salutes all the sponsors for the 2009 Total Outdoorsman Challenge. Hey, welcome back to the 2009 Field and Stream Total Outdoorsman Challenge presented by Mobile One. I'm Kelly Gotch along with Eddie Nickens, and so far we have been blown away by the action in the shotgun event. That's right, Kelly. Let's take a look at our leaderboard and see where everyone stands so far. Right now, we are down to our final four competitors. Cade Crawford logged a score of 24, while Justin Brown is in the books with a score of 18. Tom Boatwright holds a thin lead over Ryan Straley with a 36. Stepping up now is David Smith and John Sappington. David is our wild card competitor, while John, he's a hometown boy. Let's kick it back to Alan for the action. David Smith and John Sappington getting set up for their first shots of the 2009 Total Outdoors Challenge. And there it is. Opens it up with one point. Water recovery. You can see he left his safety on right there. Click the safety off, come back, let the nerves get away. He made a good shot. There's a good three points right there. You can tell John's had a shotgun in his hand a time or two. That's no points. Dead one bird. Here comes the four bird. Dead. Total of five points. That's two misses in a row. He's having a tough round. Hit and lost. Oh. Lost and lost. That speed and distance is getting these guys. Here comes the six. Got it. Great shot. Sappington came out with a solid score of 33, but it's still not enough to catch Boatwright. A tough showing for our wild card competitor. A score of five will put him at the bottom of the leaderboard. We're down to our final two competitors. Chris Reed, I'm from Thompson Station, Tennessee. I really have never competed in any shotgun events or, or competition. The mental toughness is gonna be the determining factor in, in who wins or loses this thing. John Stanley from b Dice, Texas. I have been thinking about something like this my whole life. I, I really think I got a shot at winning this thing. Chris will be up first. That six bird is in everybody's head. Here we go. Chris starts with a dead pair and three points. John's hanging right with him. Chris just inkballed that first bird. And lost the second one. Great pair, Chris. Four points. I'm telling you right now, these guys are on that one bird. Smoking it every time. the five, six points. Chris is tearing these birds up. This is the best round we've seen yet. Oh. All right, this is a big shot. Come on, brother. Yes, good shot. Got the six. That was a great round. You can see by his reaction coming off there. He's excited about that one. After only missing one bird, Chris Reed's score of 47 has won him the shotgun competition. Chris, congratulations. You really smoked him out there today. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, I did. I got lucky, I believe. Were you nervous out there at all today? Very nervous. This is the first time I've ever been to the TOC, and the level of competition here is, is tremendous. 
Well, you shot like a pro, Chris. Congratulations and good luck the rest of the tournament. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Scoring for the Total Outdoorsman Challenge is pretty straightforward. The first place finisher in each discipline gets one point, second place finisher gets two, and so on. At the end of all seven events, the final scores are tallied, and the competitor with the lowest score walks away with high honors. There's only one 2009 Field and Stream Total Outdoorsman. So after one event, Chris Reed is off to an early lead with a point total of one. We'll see if he can hold on through the remaining six events. Join us next week when our competitors head to Table Rock Lake for bass fishing and test their nerves on the 22 rifle range. It's only the beginning of the 2009 Total Outdoorsman Challenge.